Hey guys, this is K0MRD, your radio prepper, and I am here to bring you an, an idea for a communications plan, okay? It's imperative to create a communications plan with your group in case of an SHTF situation ever happens. <clears throat> I'll give you an idea of what should be in your communication plan. Please use it and edit it to suit your group's needs. First thing you'll need is a way to communicate with each other. This could be amateur radio, CB, FRS, GMRS, or your cell phones. All right, each member of the group should have the same information, such as frequencies programmed into your radio if you're using um, amateur radio or GMRS, or the frequencies that you or the channels you'll be using on FRS and CB. They'll also need to know the times to monitor or listen and the times to transmit. And you will need to practice this. Practice, practice, practice. The first thing... Ah, sorry. I've been following Amron's Channel 3 idea, which is monitor 146.420 megahertz on the 2 meter band to see if anybody requires assistance. I also monitor channel 3 on my CB at the same time in order to pass any information coming from that avenue. All right. All this is done at specific times and that's set forth by Amron. Um, this has given me the idea to present this to the prepper community. So come up with your plan. All right, what actually needs to go into the communications plan? This needs to be done before before an SHTF situation. And I'll break this down. Who are you going to communicate with? What manner will your communication be? Will it be CB, FRS, GMRS, amateur radio, or cell phone? Will there be a timetable for you to monitor and uh, and communicate via your chosen method of communication and does everyone in your group understand what to do when to do it you got you have to that has to be paramount everybody has to know beforehand what to do before the shit hits the fan for me I choose ham radio that go figure I will monitor national calling frequency on 2 meters, which is 146.520 megahertz for 10 minutes every hour, simultaneously listening to channel 3 on my CB. I will also participate in local nets on their respective peter repeaters. I also have my cell phone ready with pre-programmed, you know, you've got people outside your area, you have their numbers text them let them know you're okay should you know something be happening um, I encourage you to set up a comms plan with your family your group your tribe your mag whatever set one up have two people present if you guys are that um, official uh, you have to understand the methods you're using if you're using amateur radio, you have to know the frequencies. You have to know what simplex frequency you're using, your group is using. You also need to know what, if any, repeaters you'll be using. Now, that information can be found on radioreference.com or repeaterbook.com. I have on my Discord a listing of several states' repeaters. Uh, look it up. That's that's what it's there for. Utilize it. So I really encourage you all to set up a plan before the shit hits the fan. That way you guys are ready, at least as far as communications go. All your other preps should be prepared too. You know, everything should be ready. So go forth. Set up your plan. Engage your plan. Use you know, practice with your group. Make sure everybody understands how to use the, their chosen method. All right? 
So, simple, easy breakdown. I will have a link to this document that I have written. I'll put a link in the description. It'll be down below. So, this is K0MRD, your radio prepper, wishing you all the best. God bless. Take care. 7-3.